Hey, what's up guys? So today I'm gonna to be doing a little bit of a different video. Uh, I'm not gonna be doing a, uh, a type of video where I record it, then do a voiceover and like edit a bunch. Uh, I'm just gonna kind of talk you through it. All right, so uh, I've taken on this project. Uh, it's probably one of my biggest yet. Uh, I'm gonna create like almost a full Iron Man suit. Uh, not quite, but like pretty close. Uh, it's gonna have a mask, it's gonna have two arms, and it's gonna have a chest piece. So. Oh yeah, and it's going to be fully functional, that's the, that's the main part. So today I'm going to be talking about the mask part. So here's a drawing of what I made. Basically uh, I'm going to be creating an Iron Man type suit. Uh, it's not, exact, it's not uh, going to be an exact uh, replica of the Iron Man suit. But basically, I'm gonna incorporate a lot of its features. Uh, I'm gonna have a list of features right here that I hope to incorporate. Uh, so we'll see if they all work out. But um, yeah, basically, so uh, I'm starting off with the helmet design. So I drew this up. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Uh, as you can see, I incorporated a little bit of the Iron Man design uh, with the eyes, and then I just kind of like made some stuff up down here. Um, the idea is to get glowing eyes, um, probably glowing uh, these things, we'll see if I can get them to glow. Uh, maybe these things. And uh, yeah, here's what it's going to look like from the side. So you got kind of the eyes and then you got these cool um, striped things and you got the front. You got these cool like diamond things that will hopefully glow. So yeah, I'm going to make this out of a paintball helmet. Right here, as you can see, I kind of based the design uh, off the paintball helmet. So uh, it'll be easy to make. I can just 3D print. Oh yeah, I'm also getting a 3D printer. So yeah, I can just kind of 3D print out all these pieces and uh, fit them on. Oh yeah, also I um, when the paintball helmet came, um, it was clear, kind of like this, but I added some tint to it to give it a kind of a cooler look. So if we slide this in here, you can see it's not all the way in, but you can kind of get an idea of how it's going to look. Alright, so what I've done so far is uh, I've been working on the light up eye parts. So my idea is to take, for each eye, take two flashlights. I just ripped apart some, uh, some cheap flashlights, uh, got the lights out of them. Uh, I'm going to sandwich them around this uh, acrylic and uh, or plexiglass and um, they're gonna be like that and uh, it'll get a nice diffuse of the light uh, here I'll show you what you mean I actually made the left eye already this is what it's gonna look like it's gonna sit behind uh, it's gonna sit behind the mask and light up so let me grab a battery we attach the positive lead to the positive wire the negative one to the negative we can get it to light up and you can see it looks pretty cool actually. I do say so myself. So it'll sit here, kind of right in here. And uh, I can actually see underneath this part. You don't actually look out right here, you look out a little bit below. So that works out quite nicely. Um, so yeah, it's gonna kind of look like that. It's not quite positioned right at all actually. But yeah, it'd look like that. And you can't see it when it's off. It's actually really cool. That's kind of why I'm putting it behind the tint, even though it does make the light itself a little bit less bright. But um, I think it's going to be worth it. So I uh, just finished up wiring in the lights and uh, I just want to show you guys how it looks. There, you can see the lights come on. Looks pretty cool. Which side. I might actually, uh, once I get my 3D printer, um, reprint out like just like a, an outline for LEDs. 
because um, they're a little rough right now. Because uh, I just used tape to board with the outline, but I don't know, it looks pretty good actually. I don't know, we'll see. Oh yeah, and as you can see, when the light's off, you can't tell that there's any sort of light in the mask itself until we turn it on, then you can see that the eyes glow. So, so yeah, what I have to do next is just um, make the top part of the head and uh, make all the face features and uh, yeah, then we'll be done with the helmet. So yeah, this is just part one, so uh, let me know what you guys think, if you have any ideas. Uh, still in the very early stages, so um, we'll see how this ends up turning out. Uh, so yeah, uh, let me know what you guys think. If you like this video, please subscribe and uh, share it around. It really helps out my channel. And uh, as always, thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.